Hey guys, I'm Kalila Reynolds, and like many of you, I've been watching my light bill like a hawk since this pandemic started with work from home, the kids are home, the light bill has just gone through the roof. And so now I want to figure out how to read my meter and I want to show you how to do it. So I've invited JPS to my home to show me how to read my meter. Hi Renee, welcome to my humble abode. Thanks for having me, Kalina. Please show me how to understand this meter because I climbed up there and I can't figure out what all these numbers are. All right, let's go. So there are currently two types of meters. We have the analog meter and we have the smart meters which we are currently installing. Now for this year analog meter, this is how you read it. So the current reading on this meter is 14463 kilowatt hours. The meter number on this meter is in the bottom panel, which is 1145826. So this here is another analog meter. Now this analog meter has a digital display. Now with the digital display, as you look at the meter, you'll see your reading. The reading on this meter is 01461 kWh, and that is the reading that is used to calculate your consumption. The meter number on this meter is 1907020. So previously we went through the analog meter, now we have here a smart meter. Now with smart meters, the meters cycle between different screens or different channels that gives you the meter number, the date, the time, the reading that is used to build your account. It's okay if the meter goes to busy while you're looking at it because the meter um, cycles through different channels and once it's synchronizing on the network, it goes to busy, but that's normally for a short period. Now you're seeing the meter number, 2159952. The reading for this meter is on channel one. You see the KWH and the reading is zero kilowatt hours because nothing is connected to this meter currently. You have one of the newly installed Aclara smart meter that we have been installing island wide. Now with this meter, it sequences through different channels and you can get your meter number, your reading. On some meters, you get the time and the date. Now for your specific meter, what you're seeing now is the meter cycling. So the first thing you will see is the meter number. The first thing here is 2408260. You see that? That's your meter number right there. Next, you will see the reading that is used to calculate your consumption on channel 4. And that is 4 with KWH. Your current reading is 11782. All right, let me see if I get this. Here's my meter number, 2408260. And the next thing I'm going to do is look for my consumption, which on my particular meter comes up on channel 4. It may be different for you. And this is gonna show me the amount of electricity I've used since they installed this meter on my home. That's 11,783 kilowatt hours. So how did I do, Renee? Did I get it right? Yes, you did, Kalila. You did great. The good news is by 2024, all JPS customers will have a smart meter. Awesome stuff. Well, thanks for stopping by and showing me how to read my meter. Thanks for having us. So you guys, you can now go outside and read your own meter, leave your comments below and tell me if you were able to do it, if it was as easy as Renee explained.